Hello everyone, welcome back to the series of tutorials on Python programming. I am Deepa Kunyal and in this tutorial I am going to discuss about command lines. In previous tutorial we discussed about Python functions and now I am going to proceed a bit further and discuss about command line arguments. So what is a command line argument? Let us first create this program and then understand the meaning of command line practically. So I am creating this program command line dot pi just save this program it's blank as of now so whenever I am writing this Python command line dot pi so this is the program name right so whatever I am going to pass now one two three and so on whatever I pass after this all these things are command line arguments so we can say that all the things that are written after the name of the program in command line cell of the OS are called command line arguments so how can we operate on them how can we use them so let's write a program first I am writing program for the sum of some numbers so it will take two numbers as an argument provide four spaces and then return a plus b clear so how can you call this function just write sum and pass two values and also write print function so that we can see the output of this program now write python and then command line and here is the output if you want to edit this program a bit you can pass some message here sum then comma now try to run this program again and here is sum equal to 3 clear you can do one more thing you can pass these arguments a and b from the command line like you can write python command line and then 2 3 or maybe 4 or 5 and so on right so just do one thing open this again for using these command line arguments you need to import one module and that is called sys module you will learn these things in coming lectures but as of now you should understand that we should import a module and that is sys clear after that whenever you are calling this function sum you don't need to pass hard coded values what you have to do you have to pass sys.argv so argv is a list where all these arguments are stored so in the zeroth value program name is stored in the first value the first command line argument will be stored and then after that sys.argv and here second value will be stored clear you can also print length of this sys.argv and it will be length of all the command line arguments here you can also print first command line argument or you can say zeroth command line argument and that will be name of the program now see the output of this program you have to write python or you can say python 3 command line and then if you want to pass 10 and 20 you can do so so this is length of these command line arguments so we have three arguments here one is command line dot pi second is 10 and third is 20 zeroth value is command line dot pi and then we have some 10 and 20 so this 10 20 is again concatenating like we did previously so what you have to do i hope now you know the meaning of this so you should do one thing you have to pass this argument inside int so that this value is converted into int and similarly this second value now run the program again and here is the correct output clear so that's how you use the command line arguments in python so these command line arguments are very helpful and in the next lecture we are going to use these command line arguments for one of our program right so i hope this is clear to you if you have any doubt or query regarding any of these things you can write in the comments and i will try to clear that so see in the next video with some new concept till then thank you so much mm -hmm.